For Mashable, I'm Eric Shute. Keep an eye on the sky this week. If you're lucky, you might catch a glimpse of nature's light show, the auroras. A solar flare blew off the sun on July 12th. It's expected to hit the Earth July 17th as soon as 4 a.m. Eastern Time. As NASA explains, flares are divided into categories B, C, M, and X class. Each category is 10 times more powerful than the last, so at X 1.4, this flare is enormous. NASA says the big flares can explode with the equivalent power of billions of hydrogen bombs. This one came from sunspot AR-1520. It's the result of intense magnetic activity within the sun. Solar flares are often accompanied by coronal mass ejections, which send charged particles rocketing off the sun into space. When these charged streams hit Earth's magnetic field, they can cause electrical and radio communication disruptions, bombard satellites and orbiting astronauts with doses of x-rays, and trigger the northern and southern auroras. NASA says this week's storm isn't expected to do much damage, but it is big enough that it could cause auroras as far south of the pole as New York State. And we should expect more displays in the future. The sun is currently in the middle of an active cycle that's expected to peak in 2013. For Mashable, I'm Eric Shute.